some physicist, Stephen Hawking initially actually, felt that that was the case. Uh, maybe these things do erase information. Maybe we don't care about that. Right? Maybe that's the way the quantum theory of gravity is. And other physicists, people like uh, Leonard Susskind initially, for example, Jared Zerhoeft, the, the great Nobel Prize winning particle physicist and others, felt that no, there's something wrong with our understanding. That there's no way in which we can allow these, these things to erase information from the universe, thus challenging our understanding of the basic laws of nature. So that debate was, was vigorous and went on for decade after decade after decade. And the, the reason it's interesting is because there's a very precise problem posed. So it's not some kind of thing like trying to understand a singularity or understand the Big Bang or where you can just say, well, we're miles away from understanding. The challenges were posed in a region of space, the vicinity of the event horizon, where we thought we had control of the physics.